friend to Axel when nobody else was, even when people like me questioned it. I made a big difference to him. Except he wouldn't have taken the scooter if I hadn't been his friend. He wouldn't have even been here. Axel was at a stage of his life, Jai, when he would have run into trouble no matter who he was with or where he was. Look, what happened was just a freaky thing. It could have happened to anybody. And you and I both know that death is just something you, you can't make sense of. That's exactly what everyone told me after my family died. It didn't make any difference then, and it doesn't now. Hi. Ollie's over at Madge's, so I just thought I'd come and see if you want my help with anything. Jai, are you okay? Yeah, I'm really great, thanks. I'm going for a walk. What a stupid thing to say. Of course it's not okay. No, you did as good a job as I did. I want some toast. Here's some I prepared earlier. It's too soon for him to be dealing with another tragic death. And most kids his age have dealt with losing a pet or a mm. pair of socks. He's lost his whole family and he's lost a friend and he was there both times. <laughs> Are you okay? Yeah. Y you walk down onto the road without even looking. Look, I can understand you're not having your wits about you today, mate, but let's get you home, eh, where you're less likely to get skittled. I'm okay. Come on, jump in, I'll give you a lift. I, s I said I'm fine. My dad there killed him. He just walked out on the road in front of the ute. I don't know how I missed him. Well, where is he now? Is he OK? Well, I tried to give him a lift home, but he wouldn't listen to me. He just wandered off. Well, I'm surprised he's gone anywhere near the road after what's happened. Now, have you told Miles? No, not yet. Oh, well, I'm about to head off on a break, and I was going to go over there anyway. I'll let him know, OK? Yeah, thanks, love. But, uh... I don't get why people say sorry when someone dies. It's not like you had anything to do with it. Yeah, I know. I just... I just feel really bad for you. I'm still here, aren't I? Why are you feeling sorry for me? You know what I mean. He never liked Axel when he was alive anyway, so... Why be a hypocrite now? 